telling you, I remember one year, um, just three <laughs> huge mounds had got under my breakfast bench, Ooh, and they scary. were all in the closets mm. and drawers. <clears throat> it was pretty wild. Yeah, that's yeah. you don't forget that. No. And they're going through my kitchen right now, Garth. Yeah. Are no. they tearing up your place? Yeah, I've had ants that come over and I'm like, you gotta get out. You've never given me a decent gift for my birthday. Just leave. Get out. Go. I agree with you, Garth. Yeah. Chase them out with a can of raid. All right, hey everybody. 88 degrees right now. Windsor comes. Nice to be have you back, huh, Pat? Uh, humidity 37% in the dew point right now at 59. Listen, it's hot, it's humid out there. Temperatures are better than where we were, but with the humidity, it feels much warmer out there. Obviously, please, again, I implore you to make sure your dogs, your cats, everybody's inside cool and they have plenty of water. There's 88 degrees right now. I don't know why that just went back, but it did. All right, 100 out towards San Bernardino. Let me move you through, show you the difference. We're down a couple of degrees, but that's a wash. It feels warmer just because of the tropical clouds. 96 is where we went today. So we're below where we've been but still well above normal. You can follow the easterly wave just on the base of the high pressure area that's off to the east. And occasionally we'll just get some showers drifting through. A lot of this is Virga not hitting the surface. But look out towards Vegas and Havasu. A huge line of thunderstorms moving in towards this area. If you're thinking for whatever reason, vacation, you're going out to the river, out to Havasu or Vegas, you're going to run into this over the next several hours. And out towards Phoenix, it is very severe right now. Look at there. They've got flooding going on in these boxes, severe thunderstorm warnings, and some hail being flooded flown through there. That's all part of that easterly wave that continues to propagate itself towards us around the base of the high pressure area. So here we go. We continue sticky conditions. If you've never been to Texas, South Florida, Michigan, Pat, in the summertime, this is a little taste of what you get down there because you get humid conditions. Temperatures are up there. It feels warmer by a good five to seven degrees than what it should be. And we're going to stick around with that for a while. And you can see down towards Texas, we're picking it up there. The great state of Tejas has been hit hard this week down towards the east as well. So here is the seven day. A quick look at it. Temperatures come down slowly. We stay sticky though. Finally, as we get towards the weekend, we'll start to dry things out a little bit and start to be back towards normal. But for the next three days, we have a chance of a shower, a thunderstorm to the mountains and the deserts, or sprinkles across the street or across the, the uh, valley locations a little closer in over the next couple of days. We'll keep you updated. We'll have another check in a little bit. Back to you guys.